Well, moving on, child. So, Brad, honey, I heard you was out here, baby, pouring all the tea, honey, and it was on yourself <laughs> and Dan. So, Brad, so you were on Candy Burry's show called Speak On It. And you, honey, for sure spoke on it, baby. Now, you revealed that you dated NBA baller Mr. Allen Iverson years back. And why it didn't work mm. out, child? So, let's just take a look. I used to wake up and pick okay. his clothes out and cook breakfast and off when he woke up in the morning, you know, the things he liked, just made sure he was happy. <laughs> and he spoiled me and made sure I was happy. Like, I was like, this is amazing. Like, I was like, this is it. But then I think, you know, basketball players, hoes, okay? Right, like, true. he had a baby mama, some kids. He had a lot of stuff going on. So, it was good for a minute. It was good for a long time. Uh -huh, so it just didn't work out. It just didn't work out. He, oh, okay. he it too, too many Ooh, ooh. All right, all right. Okay. Well, honey, spilling so, the Brad, tea. Now, people knew you dated Allen Iverson, but baby, now you poured this tea, child. Why now? I don't see what the big deal is. I don't know what people thought, but honey, I am all woman. I am all things, darling. I don't know all what. All right. Can I please tell you what <laughs> the big deal was? What Go was ahead. it? I did not know, first of all, that Brett was domesticated, that she cooked, she cleaned, <laughs> she folded <laughs> towels, and she man off when she just, you know, to keep a man happy. Oh. Right. Girl, so, I was like, yeah. I enjoyed the interview, Brad. You were, you were mm, authentic. Yes. You told your life. Yes. Thank you. And if I'd have known you'd be yeah. people you. off to keep them happy, I'd have tried to talk oh. to you 10 years ago. <laughs> what? Oh. Hey, don't forget to hit us up on social media. We're on all these platforms at Dish Nation. We'll see you there.